TV Nihon. Tell it. It's seven against one, and these seven have far more experience than Captain Marvelous does. Well, then again, they are Showa writers. Still, they should be able to take on one guy. Narration. The seven writers are fighting like Marvelous is an RPG boss, taking turns while the rest waits. Pretty sure they don't have any forest stores or hyper potions on them. <laughs> That was way too easy for one person. <coughs> oh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I mean copies of the same person. Where the hell did Decade come from? Explosive transition! They've been in space before. It shouldn't be exciting to them at this point. Boy, these meteors sure have a nice blue color today. That CGI. You'd really expect the school to have some sort of monster protocol by now. I see Shun's been taking the Carter Grayson school of kicking the crap out of monsters. I bet these explosion effects were taken straight from Google. How the heck did Gentaro get blasted all the way there? Omae ga I looked you up on Kamen Rider Wiki. Oi, Gentaro's too cheerful for me. Once and off. Well damn, they sure made it fast. What, did they use instant transmission? Or did they get those communicators from Mighty Morphin Pa- Oh, wait. Gentaro lives in the Toei-verse. He should know what a Sentai is. I'll never understand how Denjimin can keep up with the electric state. Did Forze forget that fire states can absorb fire-based attacks? Or was that just the riders? Probably both. Damn, sure took Ryu a while to get there. Okay, hold on. If Meteor can be transported while transformed, why didn't he do that earlier? The other villains are just standing around while Meteor is beating the crap out of one of their own. Oh, thank God, Mr. I Mustn't Run Away is gone. Toy won't allow you to stop until they rank in all the money. Wait, Wallet, where are you going? What? Sudden Go Busters transition, what? Who would have expected that? What was the point of putting on their sunglasses if they were just gonna take them off seconds later? Pointing out how old they look doesn't make them any less of a threat. Narutaki, what the hell are you wearing? You know, it didn't end well for Sukasa the first time he took control of Shocker. But why Fies? Clock Up is cheating. Sucking up to Marvelous. Ooh, straight diss. What were AJ and Hina doing here of all places? And what were they doing in this movie? Can we take off a sin for having actors I like in this? How did AJ transform when Unksmall is broken? You know, AJ could use Godzilla Kipa and make multiple copies of himself. It could be like the old Wonderful movie. Where was Hina keeping the case? We didn't see her holding it earlier. Is that the excuse you're gonna go with to revive all of these villains, Toei? At least Narutaki didn't monologue out loud like every other villain in Toku. This is a really edgy scene. That was a really sun cut. You should call in the Avengers. He carries those wanted posters around for just such an occasion. Oh yeah! Forgot Hina-chan's in this movie. I don't think biting Doc's helmet is really gonna be very effective. <laughs> That was a direct quote from Toei. You're gonna regret this cliché. It shouldn't be this easy for DK to wipe out entire teams. Where are all the Six Rangers and Extra Riders? Oh right, this is a team-up special. Six Rangers and Second Riders don't exist. Did he just change? Was that his mobile Aw, oh, hell yeah. An all-out villain brawl. Wait, just Marvelous and Decade? That's... alright, I guess. This choreography is pretty lame, I'm not gonna lie. Breaking down fences because... You're boosting. Again? Joe really needs to chill out. Why is Tina here again? Where the heck is Navi during all of this? Haha, <laughs> get it? Pudding! Fourth wall breaking? Really? At this point in the movie? Imagine shenanigans. Because people didn't like Deno for its well-written characters who saved the world at a tragic cost, they just like the guys in suits arguing and wearing silly costumes. Time travel is always a dumb plot point. Like, why not just travel back where all of this never happened? That means baseball mask. Where are the rest of the Go Rangers? That's a really weird request that leaves a lot of questions open. If Doc still have his Gokai green powers, why can't Hina fight also? You know, Sentais are entire teens, whereas Riders are usually just one person. I'm pretty sure an entire team can beat one person. This OHA fight isn't too bad. Aqua Ranger vs. Ichigo is pretty cool. How the hell did they disguise their voices and the Deca driver? Do you even know what's going on in your damn movie? They spent 48 episodes together, and you're telling me that that meant nothing? I guess Doc and Hina didn't really feel like doing anything. Okay, so if Marvelous and Decay destroyed each other, 
The only hero left would be Doc. I guess Sentai is the winner? Oh my god, he still have a half hour left for this movie. What exactly is this purple dimension? Oh look, villains are working together after all. Sure didn't see that coming. Doc is still here. After all, there still are metal heroes, Kikaider, Tomiko Rescue Force, Jen Person, Nazman, Zubat, Grand Sazers. Probably could have come up with a better name than Big Machine. Sukasa and Marvelous planned this from the very start, and they didn't think to warn anyone? Kasa, comb your hair, you look like my grandma. It so got muddy all of a sudden. Is it just me, or these portals are a selective process? Why are Kamen Rider Black and Kamen Rider Black RX in this? Trailer fuel. Why is War Girls in the front of the line? I guess no one else is gonna call in their mechs. I'm now evil because you hurt my feelings. That's not how human beings act. How did someone get paid to write this? Just shoot the end's hand like you did earlier with Narutaki. Who knew these two random ships had a combination feature? What happened to the rest of the heroes? Did they just go home? Why is Kengo here? If he saw all of this from the city, then why didn't anyone else arrive? Brand new toys! More new toys! Subarashi! New powers and all the Gokaijers use their finisher. What a waste. The new sounds are cool and all, but they don't even sound close to their original voices. What was the point of Narutaki again? God damn it, Toei! This is so sappy! But I haven't watched Gokaiger yet, so I can't really say anything about it. Guy's exhausting his energy, so he wouldn't have anything left in Taz and Z. God, this movie sucks. Banzai!